only living things reproduce like human beings animals plants etc and what is reproduction the process by which an animal produces another animal just like itself is called as reproduction and why is reproduction necessary for all living things it's necessary so that their kind continues to live on earth for a long time how do animals reproduce as we saw in the story some animals reproduce by laying eggs like the crow reproduced by laying eggs apart from birds which all animals lay eggs fish you all know them amphibians the animals that can live both on land and in water reptiles the crawling animals like snakes lizards turtles and insects like mosquitoes butterflies house flies they all lay eggs in the story we saw the jackal was happy that its eggs cannot be stolen as they do not lay eggs they give birth to young ones apart from jackals animals like dogs cows even lion tiger give birth to young ones so how can we tell what animals lay eggs and what all give birth to young ones it's difficult isn't it how do we find it out let's play a game find out all the animals that have hair on their body lion zebra cow deer bear kangaroo squirrel dog correct they have hair on their bodies now find the animals that have external ears that is whose ears are visible easily lion zebra cow deer bear kangaroo squirrel dog those animals who have hair on their body and whose ears are visible easily give birth to young ones they are called as mammals mammals give birth to young ones they produce milk to feed babies they take good care of babies till they grow we humans are the most developed and intelligent amongst all mammals so we see there are two ways in which animals reproduce one by laying eggs second by giving birth to young ones also called as mammals you know the birds really spend a lot of time and effort building the nest they collect twigs roots wool hair cotton wool and slowly build the nest would you like if someone destroyed your home no same way we should also not break the nests if we see them around